three-year-old lab guard still got valid. There's very few changes that have happened. Oh, we didn't accept our dailies. We just we just cracked straight into it. Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Hardcore Tarkov. With you, I am your host, Bestly. Without further ado, let's crack straight into it. Our objective today is to do nothing but take the car extract in this raid because we have the phone. And if we can get to that car, it's a quest complete. Pretty sure I just shot him in the head. And I'm dead. <sighs> Man. I didn't even hear that guy. Maybe the running muffled it. I was actually gonna go the other way. Well, we don't have to do streets anymore. We hit that guy from distance. Well, we don't have to worry about that anymore. We had the, the item we needed to drop off in streets. Let's get our dailies, because I forgot to accept that. We just loaded straight into a raid, because, yeah. Interchange kill scabs with a headshot from 35 meters. It's actually a decent ski rep too. Two gunpowder kites, and we get an RPD. These actually aren't too bad, but this is good. I rate this. Hello. Survive three customs. The only issue I have with this whole Survive 3 Customs bit is the only thing I need to do in Customs is PvP. So I might. What else do we have for streets? Pinewood, Scav Kills, The Door, Dandies, and once again. We should get this done. It's really simple. Concordia Security. Let's go into Lexos. We need a LEDX. What are we going to do for a LEDX? If we got this, it'll be nice. Because then we'd have our Intel Center too. We also need two more ceiling foams. Two ceiling foams. Foams. Sorry. Three light bulbs and two fleece. Three light bulbs, two fleece. Remember this. Remember this. As the time. Uh, vents need motors, I think. Two more motors for that. Just need the vents done. And two more helixes. Let's go in other streets. Oh, and there's, for the AK-74N, is that the gunsmith we're still on? We just need... Two more ramp. Maybe we, maybe we go back to interchange. But we have um, four means armed customs. We've gone full circle, but we're going to customs. We're going to go to the. We're going to do it in four means armed, and we're also going to try and get a PVP kill in dorms. Might even just do it with a shotgun. Did we finish Punisher on shoreline for scabs? No. So we need the twelve gauges for that. Another thing we should do. Just not a good armor. It's just like it's barely, barely classed as an armor to me. 
teapots. All right. Um, dorms keys. We can do a good loot of dorms. And where are we on the peacekeeper quest line? That's just the admin building. So that's not even that difficult either. Okay. And our weekly is to get vases. I think we have the gold chains now. Oh, we need two more gold chains, three more vases. For 34k XP. Okay. Took a while to get there. But we're going to survive three customs. We're going to do informed means armed. Because that gives us chumming. We're going to do uh, one kill in the dorms. And if we can find a Ledex bonus. A little bit of a workaround to get there, but we finally got there. Hardest part in this is just going to be get that kill in the dorms. Inform means armed gets us chumming. And that means we can go to interchange and kills will actually count towards something. I think doing bullshit will be really difficult. I honestly believe if we get a, a good run of like, we have a few quests to give 30,000 plus XP. I'm like if we can get a bit of a run happening, we could probably get 38 today. You're not able to do quests. Why is that? I don't know what you mean. Perfect spawn for informed means armed. Will make us a little bit late to the dorms, but that's fine. Should do it in the mini raid series? No. Thanks for all the great content, no worries. Uh, Goose is with the tier three sub for 44 months. Can we get some sludes up in the chat? It's a tier three sub for 44 months. Uh, I started streaming a month ago and I have like 30 followers. What advice would you give someone to grow their channel? If you've got like whatever hours you have in a week to content create, make half of it for streaming and the other half needs to be making short form content and long form content. So YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, all those things. If you're... Trying to grow as a content creator and all you do is stream, you're setting yourself up for, for failure. And I would say that um, if you want to do it as a hobby, that's perfectly fine. But if you actually want to make a career out of it, you needed to do more. And um, I guess the, the best thing I could say is treat it like a business. You want to make a successful business? How do you do that? So you got to, you know, be discoverable. You want to have the best product possible, which is the creativity you use. I don't remember the items I need. I don't think I need double A bats. And I think we finished with all the blue tape we needed. It's just a scav.
Who do you reckon it is? Not every door starts closed, but... Large amount of two. What, um... So it's informed means arms are dormed to kill and our daily wants us to survive customs. Which I don't really care about any of this. Like the XP. I think it's a ragman. I suppose the ragman rep. As you know, we got past... Oh, fuck. I'm stupid. We got past the, um... I think I just heard someone. It's hard without contacts in here. There's two, two PMCs. It's not two PMCs. So there was a PMC went up to the third floor, but the two scavs, nothing. Didn't want to do anything. What a fucking load of shit. Mm, it's so lame. <sighs> I hate fighting in dorms. I, I like third party in dorms. It's the only time I like going into dorms. Well, I had a spawn right next to it. So what was I going to do? Just, you know, run away to come back later. That's done. Do we have the AP? Well, I think we do. Let's just AP someone. 
One shot, one opportunity. We'll do one more customs, see how we go. Any hot takes today? Mate, they're still brewing over that. EOD is not is pay to win. All my other takes are probably being like lukewarm at best, but the, the EOD pay to win one? Oh my God. Twitter is having a field day over it. I have to get the dorms. I gotta run, restart my PC to see if this works. Some window setting I change. Yeah, my shirt first shot is not. I oh, know it is cool. There you go. <sighs> Cat, no. Nope.
Thank you. Blows my fucking brains how a little tiny step, because I'm creep walking, I'm not able to step up. Like, how ridiculous is that? Like, I'm literally like... But Nikita, the sandbag, it's too tall for me. I can't stand up. It's half a step. I'm literally looking at it going, what the fuck? Just step on it. I'm literally like looking down there like I just want to do a quiet step up onto it. And I'm holding V, I'm doing all my vaulting buttons, I'm trying to just walk, creep walking, stand walking. Knees only have 15 degrees of bend. Fucking true. All right, that's done. We don't need flash drives anymore. No. Nope. All right, we got two, we got two um, custom stars done. We got four means armed and we got the office, uh, and we got the uh, dorm skills. So now there's really not much requirement for us to go back there. Oh, I don't really want to do this. Uh, we should look for lions and vases. Oh, we're actually crafting a, a black rock, right? We just need to find one Cordura. All right, this is our street raid. Some more condensed milk wouldn't hurt either. Should I? I think I should. It's gonna have to be T45Ms. Oh, I'll restart PC. All right, usually I get around 100 FPS on streets. I'm gonna restart my computer. Hey, chat, I can still read you. All right, while well, my PC's restarting. Hopefully this will fix it because before my new computer, which wasn't very long ago, I used to get like 120 FPS on the streets. And my new computer is better than my old one. And I don't know what's causing the uh, FPS drop. And there's a Windows setting. Apparently, if you turn it off, it gives you like a massive FPS increase. Something about like virtual machines and stuff. So let's hope. If it works, I'll tell you what it is. If it doesn't, then I'll, I won't tell you because I don't want to like waste your time. All right, PC's restarted. M2 drives are so amazing. Started playing this game because of your videos, Pestilly. So far, I'm level 29, 200 PMC kills and 500 hours in. Nice. You're doing really well. Stop it. You might get better than me. Didn't bring any money for the car, but we've got a tarp bank. Oh, one thing I would like to do is take the keys out that I don't need, but <sighs> too late now. We're going in. Do you have your setup posted anywhere? I feel like I get an average 140 FPS, 1440p. No shot, my rig is better than yours. I got a 14900K, 4090 graphics card, 64 gig of DDR5 and an M2 drive. Like I said, I'm not sure what's causing it. Um, let's see if I have better, better increase in FPS on streets. If you are buying a 4090 and skipping on other components, you shouldn't be going for a 4090. Depends on what games you play, I guess. Like Tarkov is not graphics card, like graphics card uh, heavy. So you're better off going for a slightly lesser graphics card, but maybe better CPU or RAM. But for example, uh, if you play, I don't know, Call of Duty. Your GPU will be a lot more in demand than your graph uh, than your FPS uh, than your CPU. It worked. I have better FPS. Let's go outside. Yeah, it 100% worked. Like, remember yesterday or the day before, I was sitting on like 80 to 90 FPS. Okay, this is the setting I changed. Let's get in here so I'm out of the way. Um, what did I say? change? What did I type? Hold.
Just so you don't see me doing some weird dodgy shit. This is what I actually did. So. Turning off memory integrity. So you literally t press your Windows key. Go to core. Type in core isolation. And then just have it turned off. Alright. That's all I did. And then I already had this off. When I looked up this one. Windows key. Windows feature. In the search box. Turn Windows feature on or off. And then. Make sure that's unticked. Mine was already unticked. But uh, this one is what I actually just turned off. And I, I was... You saw the other other raids. Um, I was on like 80 or 90 FPS on streets and... Big increase. All right, our objective on streets is quite simple. Get to crash site. Just sucks we have to go through so many hot spots to get there. We need to start finding some armors. I should actually change my shadow setting as well. Alright, our objective is also to find vases. So, my plan of attack for this raid, if I can survive it, is go... Happy start to a streak pest. Thanks, dude. Talk of content on YouTube and Twitch provide a much needed distraction. Keep it up. Where's man? Oh, we, need, we need two lines as well. I want to go through Concordia. I'm just checking this because it always always gives me an M4. Not today. It is not at this day. I reckon there's a gunsmith that uses this. We need RAM. Do we need PSUs for anything? Joe Hill, thanks for the five months, dude. I've got room for one key. finished junky either so we could hold on to items that we can use for junky like hot rods and that uh gasano og thanks for two months is this offline no call me smarty thanks for the prom okay i'm shooting a shotgun to our left where we died the last streets road. Just out here. Cordura spawns in here a lot. We need one Cordura.
we got? Ooh, that's nice. Oh, bruh, we're getting out. Fuel conditioner leads to blood of war part three, which is another woods task. That door's open there, so someone's probably been in check. game sometimes. That fucking sucks. Where did he shoot me from? Inside the building? It straight up makes no sense where that guy killed me from. No, he shot me with his like SR2M. He was inside the check building. That's the only place that makes sense. I don't I think we have any ammo for this. Mm, we do. My YouTube views for the month of January turn out really good. Um, wait. Building my end. I know which one. Please say crash site. Collapse crane. It's on the way. Um, we hit 13.2 or 13.3 million views. About eight or nine million of them were uh, long format, which is like, let's be real, the long format's where you make the money. So it's really nice. Um, like, short format's really good for discoverability and get yourself in the algorithm, but long format's where you actually make money. So that was really cool. And um, it's probably our biggest increase in subs in a long time too. I need fleece. And cordura. So yeah, probably the biggest month we've had in two or three years. So it was a really good. Appreciate everyone who watches the YouTube. I can't take all the credit. Like Narford has been working his ass off. Need them for woods. Man. Need to find another fuel conditioner. I don't think I need... Actually, no, two drills I can turn into a motor, so... The motor beside the oh my god, I did too. We have crash site and expo, I think. I 
don't think I need any more green bats, but I'm going to hold on to it just in case because they can be kind of annoying to find. No, not yet. I can't, I can't fathom his shit. I'm playing so bad. He wasn't even looking at me when I shot him. 268 damage, nine hits. Nine hits. I think I shot him through the rail and the rail took all the damage. I had two motors on me as well. I just need one cover. This is how the other day started. The other day started where I died like six raids in a row. And then the second half of the like the stream was just nothing but Ws. So it's just, sometimes you just have these happen. If there is the door key in here, I'm going to lose my brain. Nope. Crash site, collapse crane. I think I might just loot dental for a minute. And then maybe Skaz will come after me and I can... Get more kills over here, get some loot. Get a better loadout. Do I need one or two more mechanical parts or do you think we're past that? I definitely need light bulbs. The new patches are only available through quest, right? Is there, is there another way to buy? Um, you can buy one off, uh, Peacekeeper level two. Problem is, if I, if I find a vase, I'm not going to be able to fit it. Or a lion. 
I need a scav. Oh, fuck. I literally cannot catch a break on streets. I should stop going streets. Missed him. I don't think factory is going to be helpful, guys. Do what we need to do. Love the new chill music between raids. Cheers, pest. Thanks, dude. Pestily salute. I are uh, JR. Thanks for the eight months. I'm um, working on two more albums that will be Tarkov focused. One album is going to be. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to go any further. I'm going to leave it at that. But if you are interested in listening to my music, um, it's on Spotify. Look up the artist Pestily, and uh, you can use it on streams and YouTube. At any risk of DMCA strike. Mr. Trink, thanks for seven months. Itachi, thanks for the three months. <laughs> Sir, you hurt me! Why you shoot me? Just a poor little boy. Slug was on his chest. I gotta stop playing passive. That was a that was square on his chest when I shot. Missed. It missed. That shouldn't have missed. We got one kill at least. Would you agree playing more aggro there was play? In hindsight, easy to fucking say that. I knew he was on top of the hill and he saw me jump down from the hill. That's why I went back up on the rock. Because he was like, and aiming with a, um, aiming with a Mosin, you know is exhausting. So it's easy for me to go, 
Cool. The longer he has to try and ADS at me, the longer it's going to be for... The longer it's harder it's going to be for him to... Didn't I get like... Oh, there it's in this one. I was going to say, didn't I get a bucket load of AP20? Far out. Do you reckon there's a guy on the hill that's going to just clap me as I come down? Yep. Long range AP20 snot, you reckon? Is that the play? What a fucking horrible spawn. The only other spawn is like go through the fucking, what's his name? Two hours of death. The only other spawn was for me to go through the other place and it would have been like the water treatment and I'm a bear and I would have just got destroyed. And that was square on him again. I don't know how the shotgun missed that. Double barrel wouldn't have missed. I've never had issues shooting AP20 from range before in the kill her. I'm aiming at the center of the chest. Uh, I don't think I have any slickers. You couldn't even use the argument here, like, first, you should slow it down when literally, like, I can't even leave the spawn there. And on the line, uh, the previous raid, I went up the hill, killed a player to my left, and had another player in front of me. It's like, even if I want, what, unless I literally don't even move, like, what, like, there'd be nothing I could do in that situation. In both of them. I think I'm running out of backpacks I can buy. I need hard draws for something as well. We're just gonna have to do some zero to heroes. It's not like we haven't got any progress though. Like that's at least the benefit, like the, the good out of this. I did see they took AP in my flame. I don't know why it's such a big deal to people. Like they've taken pretty much the, the, the best round of every gun off flame. I don't know why everyone's losing their mind of APM. Hey, Pestilli, can you boost me to level 15? I am noob in this game. Yup, uh, just gift 100 subs and I'll get one of my uh, my boosters to help you out. Don't say that, some mad lad would do it. <laughs> For legal reasons, that was not a joke. <laughs> you know the interesting thing? I don't even think you'd technically be... Nice. <laughs> it was a joke, Captain Char. <laughs> All right, looks like I'm leveling Captain Charles to 15. Can we get some salutes up in the chat for the 100 gifted subs from Captain Charles? I actually think, like, there, ethically, there is something wrong with it. Ethically, there is something wrong with it, but I don't technically think you would actually get banned for RMD unless you, like, advertised for it. If some dude was like, hey, can I get a, a boost level 15? I was like, give me 100 subs, I'll do it. Like, that would be, like, as a once-off, I think that would be fine. But if you did it, like, as a paid service, then yeah, you'd be in trouble. Like if you're like every day, like, all right guys, uh, next uh, batch of gifted subs and you'll get all your, your, your boostings done. What extract? Crash site. I should just go, should go to um, straight there. I don't even know why I'm in here. I'm just gonna die. Players are gonna swarm me. Well, looks like I'm getting banned. Oh, man. Two players. I went out because it sounded like one player shooting at another one, but it was actually two players shooting at scavs. This has to be the roughest session of hardcore we've had. I died to a guy with an MP9. There's another guy out there with a suppressed shotgun. 
This is the roughest session of hardcore in a long time. Um, all right, we actually need to just play smart and go get some armor and stuff. I think no streets, no lighthouse. We need to go like, I don't know. We could do, okay, so we could do streets, but I'd, we'd have to do nighttime and just avoid the hot areas. Mm, it might be a nice time to do it. I'm gonna try one more time, but this time I'm deliberately gonna try and avoid all the hot spots. Go kill some guys in factory for some armor. I don't if I if I'm losing all these other fights, I don't think factory is gonna be much of a difference. I need to like like full reset my brain. Woods actually wouldn't be a bad idea, but the only thing I really need on woods is um lead X's. I don't really need to do anything else on woods. Alright. Time to die. There's a couple of crate uh, jackets here. <sighs> Screwdriver. Ribbed. Where are the other two scabs? Just one of these days, we will get past the spawn. The hardest boss of all of Tarkov. Might even need to run intro and restart stream to get rid of some of this bad luck. All right. Oh, that's actually the really... That's good. All right, cool. The problem is, I don't mind going shoreline, but going shoreline without any sort of like rig and stuff would be kind of yucky. Uh, let's just do this any shoreline keys on us we have actually a few shoreline quests actually we've got colleagues part two which we have the cottage key for and we have wet job which is just in the uh admin building and we've got chemistry closet if we're late we might be able to find it open all right we can do some hidden stashes and watch us get the spawn that's like the one right out front of the new area and we won't have a bag shoreline to cleanse the palette yeah this has been brutal have I survived anything today? I went customs died. I went customs again and died. What's probably happening right now is the majority of players are starting to unlock the Bitcoin farm. And now they've got unlimited money. That's probably what's happening now. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Shoreline, what could possibly go wrong? Really bad spawn. But, but we can make it work. We can make it work.
probably not a really bad spawn if we just want to get hidden stashes though. Come on. Huge one. Give me a big armor. Big armor. A gun. Okay, we've got our food and drink sorted for the raid. All right, next one. Is there still a hidden stash here? Probably not. Probably moved. Should I go out to the pier, grab the item, and just take the boat extract? And then that's a win. That's what we haven't done. We just haven't got a win under our belt. That's, that's one of the things we used to always do if we had a big losing streak. Just, just get an, an easy dub. All right, we'll go down to the pier. We'll grab the item and then take the, the boat extract if it's up. We just need a fat dub. Exactly. They've changed how this all looks, so I don't know where the hidden stashes are now. Because it used to be like in a bush around here. And there used to be like a little cabin thing there. Could be in one of these now. Yep. Bad plan, go kill Senator. That's the next task. Tier will be open, I believe. What are my dailies? Got the weekly interchange. Eliminate scavs with headshots from 35 meters. We could we could try and get decontamination done. It's a pretty brutal task. It's open. It's open. Please, Nikita, Lord of Ballistics, give us this win. I don't have anything for the last line, but you get the point. Huge armor. Rig. Rig. I don't actually need any caps, but... Two light bulbs. Let's just try and get them. We don't need wreck bats. I don't think we need caps or anything either. Don't need matches. Matches aren't a barter trade for something. Maybe we just start stocking. We'll grab whatever we can. Melboros. We needed Melboros. Um, I think they turn into SVDs. Don't need Zippos. Watch him find a line in the safe. Don't. Oh, new key. Proxim just money. I draws another backpack. Do I need the manual for anything? I don't exactly need that other book, but it's just sell some money. Got 
Gold chain? Don't see lion. Thank God. Making sure we've got the XP covered. It's a 20 second extract. Oh. This pier this feels so much longer. It's a 30 second extract now. Did we not bring cottage key? No, it's a We got a win! We got a win! Oh yeah! Oh, Shoreline <laughs> of all maps, Shoreline brings the win. It's only up from here, exactly. Whatever's in Hargrove, you get a run through nothing. It's just I try to avoid it because it's bad XP. Shoreline is the—I told you, Shoreline is the reset. I got you. Shoreline used to be like the Hi, worst map. Visit your family and friends, everyone. Easiest 484,000 channel points of my life. <laughs> Capitalizing on others' misfortune, are we? All right. Only up from here. All right. The other thing is... Okay. If we got to there, I'd be very surprised. <laughs> 